Relax, the Divine Mother through Isabel Hen, May 22, 2013. I see how full you pack your day, my child. From morning till night even in your free days when you don't need to work you have dates over dates. Why? You have but no time for yourself. When do you want to relax from all of this? Please don't tell me that it wouldn't be necessary. I know it. I ask you to take each day a space of time for yourself alone. Don't intend to do anything. Simply take time out. Look out of the window and look after the clouds or the birds. Watch the children playing. Don't think. Only enjoy this resting phase. You can also listen to calm music. Recline in the bathtub if you want to. But please do not work or do no sports then. You should only come to ease and relax. Switching off from the hecticness of your day and simply doing nothing. You need this relaxation, my child, I know you very well and know how much you need this. Your Shady Cites the Divine Mother through Isabel Hen May 23, 2013. My child, I know exactly why you pack your day so full with everything you can think of. You are afraid of being alone with yourself. With all the dates and activities you only keep yourself out of your way. You fear to be busy with yourself. You don't want to see the dark sides in you and hide them from yourself. But you have to look at them so that you can acknowledge them and send them to the light for dissolution. Every being in duality in the lower dimensions has light and dark sides. It is part of the evolution of your soul. Acknowledge this and you can develop compassion for the current dark side. You know already, where there is light, there is also often shadow, but the light in abundance let all shadows and darkness dissolve. In knowing that you too had your shady sides in this or in a former life, you can easier accept the shady sides of your fellow people. My beloved son Jesus told you once he who is without debt, may throw the first stone. So put the stone down you want to throw onto your fellow man. Rather send him your love like I send you my love, my child. Whatever you do or not do I love you anyway infinite and without measure. Your Divine Mother Streaming Energetic Constructs Shape Overall Gaia Consciousness 23, 2013, by Syrian Heaven. Streaming Energetic Constructs Shape Overall Gaia Consciousness as Advancement in Individual and Collective Consciousness Occurs. Severance of all non-higher path aligned timelines and intention conduits is occurring concurrently with advancement in consciousness. Peaking of resistance to standard human awareness occurs in coming months, as human awareness is nurtured and standard human awareness paradigms are dissolved. Leaps of playful joy are noted as standard human awareness paradigms are released. Allow the understanding of all, of one, to enter your hearts. Archangel Michael channeled by Ron Head we will speak today of the continuing success of the light workers in opening the understanding and consciousness in your world. We marvel at the ability of so many to avoid seeing what to us is so obvious. Each day now it becomes more difficult to interpret events, and reports of events, in other than a hopeful and positive light. There are still things occurring which we understand are not so easily understood in this way, but much more is surrounding you which is of a positive nature. Of course the loudest voices are still trumpeting the tune of fear and control. But the strains of peace, progress, freedom, love, and compassion are refusing to be pushed aside any longer. They are there for all to hear if they desire to do so. Many, many voices are adding themselves to this new chorus every day. Love and light cannot and will not be overridden any longer. As this current continues to pick up steam, it becomes easier and easier for those who have watched and waited to finally make their decisions and join in. Welcome to them. It is understood that past experiences of pain and suffering have conditioned many to stay out of the fray in self-protection. No blame is attached and no guilt should be felt. Self-preservation is one of the most basic drives of life. You may well find that those ones who have now begun to join in the awakening will throw themselves into the flow with great joy and abandon. They have waited longer and prayed harder for these changes to occur. May they find open arms and open hearts to welcome them. Look around you often now to find new evidence, however seemingly small, of this rising flood of light. It may be a drop in the ocean, but remember, it is an ocean we speak of. 
change your perspective if you are getting discouraged and rise high enough to see the waves. And remember as you give thanks to Creator for creating this, as you give thanks to us for creating this, to give thanks to each other and yourselves, as well. Allow the understanding of all, of one, to enter your hearts. In great love do we bid you good day, dear friends. We will speak again soon.